Who doesn't love the smell of freshly cut herbs? But when this herb comes to lower the high blood pressure, you have to put extra care about it. It's true that high blood pressure, or hypertension, is one of the most common cardiovascular disorders right now in the whole world. Hypertension is major contributors of cardiac complications, stroke, heart disease, kidney failure, including premature death and disabilities. On the other hand, people who have high blood pressure might be at high risk of severe illness from coronavirus disease. According to experts, spices of the right kind may also help manage blood pressure levels better. So, one such spice that you can consider using in your high blood pressure diet is coriander, also known as cilantro. Coriander, also called cilantro in North America, has been used as a digestive aid for thousands of years. It is a unique herb that you would either love or hate. Even if you've never cooked with cilantro before, you've probably eaten it. Cilantro is low in calories and is packed with an extraordinary range of nutrients. Cilantro is rich in several vitamins like A, C, K, essential oils, acids, and minerals. In this video, you will get to know the heart-healthy benefits of coriander, as well as an amazing drink that can heal your heart health. How Coriander Helps Control Blood Pressure According to studies, coriander helps you get rid of high blood pressure. It has been demonstrated that coriander lowers high blood pressure in people suffering from hypertension. It has been found that ingredients from coriander interact with calcium ions and the neurotransmitter acetylcholine, which in return helps relax tension in blood vessel. In addition, the herb is very effective to modulate gut activity, which is technically very effective for managing high blood pressure. It's a powerful antioxidant and also has anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties. It can lower your cholesterol too. Apart from high blood pressure, as coriander is a rich source of calcium, it can prevent osteoporosis and protect bone strength and durability. We know that low iron content in the blood can result in shortness of breath, heart palpitations, a decrease in brain functions, and extreme fatigue. Coriander, as it is high in iron, helps fight these types of anemia problems. It is found that coriander increases the secretion of insulin from the pancreas, which, as a result, raises the insulin level in the blood. This can help people particularly suffering from type 2 diabetes, lowering the risk of dangerous sugar spikes. Last but not least, coriander is also packed with several antioxidants. The antioxidants prevent cellular damage caused by free radicals. How to use coriander to manage high blood pressure. Okay, earlier we have manifested multifaceted benefits of coriander. You can go for this recipe to get the best possible output to fight high blood pressure. Here is the Ayurveda concoction you can try. For the concoction, you need coriander leaves, 1 cup, celery, 1 cup, water, 4 glasses. At first, get 4 glasses of water in a container. Secondly, add 1 cup each of coriander leaves and celery to it. Thirdly, boil them for 20 minutes. Finally, strain and drink that water. Try to make this recipe once a day and take it on a regular basis to reduce high blood pressure. For your kind information, people who don't like cilantro, they can go for another herb called parsley, which comes from the same plant family as cilantro and can be a smart replacement. You will get almost all the health benefits from the parsley that you usually get from coriander. By the way, you will find more smoothie recipes about high blood pressure on my channel. Don't forget to check your pressure level weekly and take food according to the result. If possible, consult with your nearest physician. So, that's all for now. By the way, for more queries, I've also added some studies at the end of this video description. Let us know in the comment section below. Please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for the next videos. And don't forget to like, comment, and share. Stay healthy. Stay fine.